What are we doing today? We're winging it. Just slide it forward and then we'll figure it out from there. How are you getting it to your house? Listen to me, I'm trying to sell my parents' chair on my YouTube channel. You could be the camera catcher. We might need a camera catcher. Because it's interesting. So you climb up in there and just kind of push it this way. Yeah. You need to always ask. You just did. everybody had a little part in getting this chair slid into the house. Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm in my husband's truck now. I thought I'd bring you along for my day because my day just got a little exciting. Not, I mean, not exciting, exciting, but exciting for me. I picked up my grandchildren. I have one. Hi. And I have one back me there. Too. <laughs> so I have. How many do I have? Two. two. Their brother had an eye appointment today, so I have the two girls for a while. And on the way home from picking up the girls, I just called my mom to see what she was doing. And she was at the store furniture store. Those of you that have been following her furniture, well, the whole living room redecoration, she bought another chair. And if you saw the video, they were doing a painting video. Yeah, the, in the painting video, that's where it all started because she bought a picture and then the picture didn't match her living room but she knew kind of it wouldn't so she was going to hire painters then to come in and it's like don't know we've got enough people in the family that you don't need to hire anything done so my husband and i went over there and painted their living room for them and then she bought a new couch and then well then the furniture store went out of business because of COVID it's been just the whole ordeal she ordered this chair off the internet and it happened to be for children I, I don't know but the chair is so stinking small she doesn't like that chair so she's replacing it with another smaller chair but she's hoping that the chair is going to be bigger so anyway all to the my point I picked up the grandkids and we were going to just go to the store and then go home. I called her and I said, what are you doing? She's at the furniture store, bought a chair. I said, oh, how are you getting it to your house? You need to always ask. You just do. She was going to hire a delivery company to go pick up the chair and bring the chair to her house. I said, no, you're not doing that. Why? No. Everybody in our family owns a truck. I have children and their husbands all have trucks. They even all have trailers that go behind the trucks. I'm like, no, you're not doing that. So I went to my husband's work. I gave him my car. I took the truck. I met her back at the furniture store. So now that's where we're at now. I'm on my way to her house to deliver this chair, which my son-in-law is probably going to have to come over maybe and help us get the chair out of the truck. I can't lift it. And uh, Gia back there can't lift it. My mom I can't. can't lift it. Maybe Haley can help us. I don't know. We're going to figure it out. Because I'm strong. What are we doing today? We're winging it. My granddaughter got in and she's like, well, we're winging today. I'm like, yeah, we're winging today. We wing every day around my house. Can we show them the digger? No, we're not showing them the digger. There's a digger up there, which is a backhoe. I have girls there. It's a backhoe. Oh, this morning I crocheted. I started crocheting a blanket for my new baby granddaughter that's not here yet. Gma is making her a baby blanket. It has it's pink like pink, and gray, and and white. And it's pink gray, and white. It's pink, gray, white. Yes, it's pink. And it's so soft. Oh boy, this yarn it's I bought. It's so soft. It's so soft. In fact, I ordered some in some blue and greens because my grandson really wants me to make Could a you scarf. make one for me too? They yeah, all me. want scarves now. Thank God they don't want all blankets because that would take me forever to make. I want a blanket. Now she wants a blanket. <laughs> of course you do. But your dad wants a blanket. My daughter's, my daughter's husband, my daughter messaged me this morning and said, now they're all fighting over this because I had a little like a strip that I made that I thought I don't like it. So instead of ripping it all out, it looked like a scarf, so I just gave it to them. And they're all fighting over this one scarf that I made. And now my son-in-law wants me to make him a blanket out of the same a scarf. Yarn. A scarf. I think Kid here ended up with the scarf, which now means I need to make another one. But right now I'm rambling, so I'm gonna shut the video. Well, I'm gonna shut the video off right now, I'll shut the camera off right now. And I'll catch up back to you later when we get to my mom's house. Well, we made it to the parents' house with the chair. Plan is to slide this off and at least get it in the garage 
until maybe somebody else could carry it in if it's not heavy. I don't know. We're going to see. Okay, Muscles how, here. How about, how about I get up there and try to push it off until it's right here or something? That's what I was going to have you do. You want to do that for me? Yeah. So you climb up in there and just kind of push it this way? How am I going to because I can't climb up that side? Well, you have to figure out how to jump up here. There. See, you're strong. All right. Just slide it forward and then we'll figure it out from there. You have to kind of get behind it. Is it heavy? I don't think so. Wait, oh, it's Teamwork. This is what's happening today. <laughs> Try to push it straight. Oh, wait, I think I got it. Move the chain. Good job. All right, I'm going to get off here and see. You want me to push it more? No, leave it there. All right. We will be back when we figure out what we're doing with this chair. Okay, guys. Do you want to know I'm filming now? Bye. Well, miraculously, we've gotten this chair in. It's a good thing it's a small chair because everybody had a little part in getting this chair slid into the house. Which we were coming in the back door and my dad said, why don't you just go in the front door? Well, I'm glad that you told us that before we started trying to get it in the back door and going up the steps and everything else. Dad. Okay, get out of the chair so I can show him the chair. It looks really nice where it's sitting. Okay, there's the new chair in its new spot. And there's the chair she's replacing. She just got this one. See, it's like a kid sized chair. I wish I could shake your I like it. Can can I take it to put in my room? <laughs> yeah, ask your mom. Here's the new chair. A little bit bigger. Because I like blue. And it matches my room. But it fits here really good. This matches my room because my room is blue, purple, and gray. So anybody really in my area looking for a little chair, hit me up. Hit me up in the comments because it's for sale now. Because it just didn't work out. It didn't work out. Yeah, so it's for sale now. And it's a brand new chair coming from a clean, smoke-free home. Listen to me, I'm trying to sell my parents' chair on my YouTube channel. Well, I'm gonna take these kids. Oh, it's made in America. The new chair is made in America. Oh yeah, the picture, I'll show you the picture where it all started. There it is, there's the picture that started it all. Oh, she did get a new picture. She got a new picture over the couch. Isn't that pretty? It matches this. I don't know if you're going to put anything on the this. other sides of the pictures, but yeah, it does match that. I love this picture. I think she got this picture from Wayfair. I'm not real sure. And that's new over there. My dad keeps saying, you know what's next, right? He thinks that she's going to go pick out carpet. She doesn't really want carpet. I think my dad wants the carpet, believe it or not. Don't know. But anyway, there's the update on the parents' living room. I will talk to you in my next video. Subscribe. You don't want to miss all the fun at my house. All right, bye.